In this video, I'm going to be talking about octave registers. When we refer to pitches, we usually use letters like A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Remember, there's nothing past G. We use a circular or cyclical alphabet when referring to uh, musical notes. The uh, letters are not good enough because there's more than one C, just as there's more than one D in all of the other notes. So we have to also refer to them with their octave register. The octave register is a number which tells you how high or how low the, the C is, since there's more than one C, there's more than one D. So we're gonna start with this pitch, which is a C4, which is also referred to as middle C. It's called middle C because it's in the middle of the piano keyboard. And um, it, if you can start with this and just commit this to memory, it will help a lot because this is right in the middle of, of the ranges. Below this pitch are considered the uh, kind of the bass and the tenor instruments, and above this pitch would be the alto and the treble instruments. This is just right in the middle, and it's C4. However you need to remember it. Uh, you can remember that uh, when thinking about octave registers, I want to make everything explode using a big block of C4. If you don't know what that is, then you haven't watched enough, uh, enough primetime television. Um, anyway, C4 is the middle range, so C4. When you go up, uh, every time you run into another C, the octave register changes. So this is C4. The next C, an octave higher, would be C5. So that's C5. And if I go up another one, we're getting up into the stratosphere now, that's a C6. And then all of the notes in between would share the register tied to its C. So again, every time you hit a C is when the notes change or the register changes. Now if we go down, we can see the same, same sort of thing. This is where C4 is in bass clef. This and this are the exact same pitch in these clefs. If I go down an octave from C4, that makes this C3. I go an octave below that, then we end up with C2. There, whoops, there are uh, registers that are above C6 and below C2, but those are extremes. So just be aware of them. And uh, really in the practical musical world, these are the registers that are used. Sometimes violins may go all the way up into the seventh octave. Sometimes the bass may go down into the first octave. The piano goes goes even way below this pitch, but practically this is the range that we should be concerned with from C2 to C6. So let's take some examples that are not Cs and see what the octave registers would be. So here's an A. This is a really important pitch. It's called the 440A. It's the pitch that most orchestras tune to around the world. The reason it's called a 440A is because it vibrates at the frequency of 440 hertz. That means that it vibrates up and down, the, the sound wave moves up and down 440 times every second. And it's a really common tuning pitch. So what register is this in? There's A, and we know that the C below that A would be a C4, because that's a C4. The C above that A would be a C5, so it's in between C4 and C5. So is that an A4 or an A5? Since we started with C4 down here, we didn't change octave registers until you hit the next C. This A will be a part of the octave register 4. C, D, E, F, G, A, all the way up to here. Let me show you all these. D, E, F, G, A, and B all belong to the fourth octave register. If we ran into this note, that would be 5. So that's a C5. If I go up to this A, that's going to be an A5 because it's the A that belongs to the fifth octave register. Now let's take a little bit of a lower one um, here. That's a G. And it's pretty low, so we know it's going to be a little bit of a lower number. The C directly above it would be a C3. That's a C3. And then that's a C2. Since this G has not yet hit the 3, this is in the second octave register. So this would be a G2. 
Get it? So that's a G2 because it hasn't hit the 3 yet. The number only changes every time you hit a C. So it's every time that it runs into a, that you run into a C that the octave register changes. So again, one more time. This is a C2, C3, C4, two C4s there, C5, C6. 